Hi, hello, and what's up, guys? I'm Jake Snooper Guy, and I'm gonna be uh, discussing the Warframe uh, companion app. And oh my, that is super live. Whew. Okay, so let's see what we got. We got our um, activities tab. Where we got alerts. If we click an alert, what does that do? Nothing. Okay. That shows the time remaining. Shows the time you know remaining. Shows when it's red, meaning it's almost gone and stuff. Shows the factions. Um, you know, show us all the basic info you need to know. Invasions? Nothing, nothing. Nope, there's that. Extractors, now you can deploy extractor. I'll just do that because I don't know what to do with an extractor. And then you can pick which one to deploy. Let's say I want Oregon cells, I'll just do Saturn. Uh, yeah, no, I don't want to. Go. No. Back. Thank you. Okay. And then you got sorties, so you can see you know what the sortie is, and then the reward pool, and whatnot. Okay, and then we got void fishers. And that's in the activities tab. And then for the news tab, it seems to be constantly getting updated and whatnot, so let's get good. We got codex. Now you can see your warframes, and if you were to click a warframe, you're able to see all that nice stuff and whatnot. Um, you're also able to see your arch wings. Uh, what's mastered would be green, of course. It's got a little mastery symbol and stuff. Um, and blue, you know, it's not fully mastered, but not. Um, <clears throat> and then if you click on one, you know, you're able to see stats. And if I were to click on an arch wing, you'll see stats and abilities and stuff like that. Um, whoops. But that works. Uh, now we go primary, and you got all the primaries to look at, and the codex, and you got, you know, that stuff. Um, I believe secondary is the same thing. There's also a search option. Let me see if I search for... I want to search for... Let's just search for Lex. Does this work? Well, finally it works. Okay, good. I don't know if they actually made it work before. I don't remember. And then you got melee. Same stuff. It might be uh, something's wrong. And then you got your companions and whatnot. If I click on one though, it's just gonna give me the abilities and stuff. Yeah, okay. Um, and then you got mods. Now they added ribbons a while back. Uh, hold on, let me just search mod. I want to search for let's just search for overextended because that's the first mod that came on the top of my head. Yep, okay. Um, and then you're able to use filter between all Warframe or augment. So blah 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 and cancel. Oh. Um, wait. Hold on, let me filter to ribbon. Is there a way to filter ribbon? Nope. Okay, cancel. Um, so that, now I'm going to go to inventory, and we got warframes. Now, I believe it should show you your mods. Yes, it will show you your mods. It shows you get steel charge. They probably updated this to be better, intensify, vitality. It also show you your rank, which is nice. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um... First off, let me just show you my Equinox, because I am crazy. I went full on Umber Equinox. Like, nuts. Yeah, yeah, I, I, I went nuts. Okay, um, so Warframes, weapons, I know I have a Riven, um, I don't really use Rivens anymore, though, which sucks. But, I want to look at, uh, what's a good Riven I have? I don't really have any good ribbons. It stinks. Oh, I, mean, I have a good one on the Stradivar. I don't have it on it, though. So, that's not. It's just, I have the ribbon on the Buzzlock. So, I'll show you ribbons and whatnot. Um, that's for the weapons. Ah, uh, wrong one. And you got your Sentinels. And that's just same stuff. Does it tell you how much mod capacity you have? I don't think it does. No, it doesn't. Um,. Then go to appearance, and then this is all your appearance items and whatnot. What if you click on it? Does it do anything? No. Um, mods, that's the same from before, except this isn't the codex. Extractors, same as before. I think if I click on it, does it say deploy? No, it just shows how many extractors you got. Gear, uh, this is all your gear. What if you click on it, though? Does that do anything? No. It shows you how many you have. Uh, keys, same story. Uh, resources slash miscellaneous. You know, find out what you have. Uh, prime parts. Nothing special. Archwing, 
it's the same as like Warframes and whatnot, and shows you what mods and shit you have. Oh, I didn't mean to swear. Arch weapons, same story as like the weapons and whatnot. Okay, so that's that. Now that's the inventory tab. Now we got the companions tab, and it'll show you have no active companion, so I need to put a companion active. And then you got stasis. Quick stasis, and you can retrieve from stasis. I don't know what happens if you do the active companion thing. I think it might show you info as well. Arsenal. So now you got your your character and stuff. So it's basically a more simpler version of that and whatnot. Okay. And then void relics. You got your Lifera, your Mesware, and your Rx. Let's just go to Neo. And let's say I wanna. You can refine it over in this section. As you can see, you also can see the rewards and whatnot. So you can refine it from your your companion app. Uh, yeah. And then you got the Poundry, which lets you claim. 41 minutes. Ah, oh, come on. Uh, you know, it shows you what you're ready to build and whatnot. You can build. Um, if I build, is that going to make it do something? Start building. No. Um, and you can also rush and stuff. So that's the Foundry. Now, settings. What do we have on here? We have notifications. You got the filter options for all this stuff. And you can choose which platform you're on. Pretty sure that's where you log out. You can also choose which way your menu is. Um, you still data about whatever you got. And then there's a play button, whatnot. Okay. Uh, platform, you could probably change that. I don't know. Probably with the login and stuff. And that's that. So it's just a smaller version. Um, that's the uh, settings. And then there's a logout button. Um, so that does it for that section. Uh, what happens if I click my profile? This, this, this. Nothing. Okay. And now we got this thing. So this will show you your friends, your pending. You can add a friend over here, hopefully, if it works. And then you got this chat button. And this lets you use your clan chat. Um, shows you who's in the clan, I guess. I don't know. I guess that's who's online in the clan. I don't know. And then you got your friends. Not necessarily online. I don't know how that works. Whatever. But there's that. I think that is everything you need to know. Yeah. Now, the only thing left to do is to, uh, that's the percentage, 21%. Ah, it's going to give me a notification. I just need to log on to Warframe over on my PC so you can see what it's going to look like when you, um, what it's going to look like when you have Warframe logged in. It should limit the amount of stuff you can do. Granted, this is going to be loud, so I probably should mute the uh, the computer. Okay, I have it running. I'm going to log in real soon. And it should limit the stuff you can do. I probably should have skipped this part, but whatever, I'm just leaving it. Okay, logging in. You are already logged in. Long here and terminate the other connection. Yes. Now, if I go back into the Warframe map, kick active section. Okay, so you can't go and access all this stuff. So you can access it when you are in your orbiter. So I'm in my orbiter right now. You can't see, um, but you you can't access your stuff when you're in a mission, which makes sense because you don't want to be on the phone and in a mission at the same time. This just doesn't work. You still will get alerts. I'm pretty sure, and whatnot. And if I were to log out, uh, inventory is grayed out. You need to log in for that stuff. So you can still get access to the activities, the news. The codex, uh, settings, and you know, login and whatnot, and you don't get access to these. 
So, that's about it. That was it for this video. This is Jack Snapper Gas saying, I'll see you guys later. Bye, and shut up, boys.